How's it going, everybody? Absolutely huge news for all you Master Chief Collection fans. Stay tuned throughout the video. You get to know what's going on with this. Anyways, guys, it's Kevin here once again, giving you another news Halo update on the MCC. If you don't know, we've been currently doing a lot of patchwork with MCC, playing the Insider program, all that good stuff. And finally, finally, is happened the update is officially starting to roll out to different users right now so a lot of people right now have been actually been able to download it i actually got a chance to play it and stream it last night and let me tell you it's been great right i will let you know that right now the playlists are really consolidated to just halo 1 2 3 and 4 and it's a mixed playlist of like slayer and objective game mode that's just because not every person has the update and so we're waiting until september 1st I'm sure is when we have the full playlist available. If you want to know what the playlists are, there will be Team Slayer for Halo 1 through 4, Action Sack, and there's also going to be a cross-play big team battle with Halo 1, Halo 2 Classic, Halo 2 Anniversary, and Halo 4. There'll be CE Team Arena, Halo 3 Big Team Battle, Halo 3 Free For All, Halo 4 Team Arena. Those are going to be all the social playlists. All the ranked playlists are going to be CE Doubles, then we have Halo 2 Team Arena, Halo 2 Team Hardcore, then we have Halo 2 Anniversary Team Arena, then we have Halo 3 Team Doubles, Halo 3 Team Arena, Halo 3 Team Hardcore. Now you're probably wondering, oh no, what about my infection, my SWAT, my snipers, and all this other great stuff that Halo has to offer? Well, don't fret. It's just that those game modes are going to be kind of filtered in as a rotational playlist for the MCC, much like in Halo 5 right now with the two rotational playlists going on right now. And that's just because it's much more of a niche game mode compared to your regular Team Slayer game modes. A really nice thing also that 343 is going to be doing is that since, you know, we've had a lot of people part of the MCC Insider Program, which I was a part of, and many others as well, if you participated in that, you actually be getting a new nameplate that will say MCC Insider on it so that you get a chance to know that these people will actually help make this game better in the way it is right now. So now you're probably wondering with the update now available for people to download for the most part, you're probably wondering what's going on with the Insider program. Well, 343 says that right now they're going to be on a bit of a hiatus when it comes to using the Insider program. So they literally say in the post right here saying, go ahead to delete it. No worries there. Moving forward with future updates, what they're going to do is have a public test realm for everyone who is part of the Insider program, owns a digital copy of MCC, or plays through Xbox Game Pass. There, we'll be able to play new versions of the MCC, so hopefully get a chance to play this content browser that they've been mentioning about it as well. And I'm still holding out hope for Halo Reach on this. Still holding that hope, but you know, we'll, we'll see what happens. So everybody, that's what's going on with the MCC. So go in, install your MCC, get that update. It's going to be great. I will also let you guys know that the update for the full version of MCC is 73 gigabytes. They're basically rewriting the entire game. So it's going to be a very long install. Though with the intelligent install that's now available with the MCC, that you can actually get into the game while it's starting to install. When it says ready to use, you're able to jump into the game and then you can use the intelligent install. And if you just want to play just the multiplayer, then you can install just the multiplayer for each game, which nearly cuts it down in half. So to figure out how to use the intelligent install, I'll show you guys right here. So when you sign in to the game, you'll see this new menu. What you want to do is go down to options and career. You press A and you scroll over to settings. Press A on that and then you'll use right bumper or whatever one you want to use to get over to where it says gameplay in the upper right hand corner. It says change installed games. You click A on that. And then you can select whatever you want to install. This is a great thing to use to help shorten down that install time for the update if you want to play just the multiplayer. Now, if you want to play campaigns as well, those will also have to go through an update and install. I don't know if you can see, but it says 73.1 gigabytes. If you uninstall just the campaigns, that brings it down to 41 gigabytes. So not exactly quite half, but a significantly smaller amount. So if you really want to start jumping and play that multiplayer, you can at a shorter time. So yep, that's the MCC Insider update coming to the retail version now. Go and install the game, please do it. Trust me, you'll enjoy it. I was streaming it all last night. It was a ton of fun. The hit registration is just great. Halo 2 Anniversary is what I was mainly focusing on. It was a great time. If you want to check out those live streams, link is in the 
the description down below if you want to follow there greatly appreciate we just hit 600 follows on that channel so i thank you so much for all the support everybody i really do appreciate it if you like these news and information videos please make sure to tap that like button as it lets me know you want to see more content like this leave a comment down below what you guys thoughts on the mcc update uh, i can only imagine positivity coming for this thing here and if you're new to the channel and want to stay up to date with anything halo related and you like the content here make sure to tap subscribe because i catch up to date with anything awesome on the channel and then we'll catch you all in the next video check out the videos on the screen right now if you've missed any content from me i'll catch you all in the next video peace out